In this video, I will show you how quick and affordable it is to bind your own books with the cinch. Bind your own books with three steps. Punch, bind, and cinch on any size project. To use, unhook the strap to release the handle. Follow the chart on the tool or refer to the instructions in the box. Practice first on a piece of scratch paper. Find your book size on the chart to determine which peg to pull. For an eight inch book, I'll pull out peg four. Slide your paper in and align to the left guide and punch. Slide your ruler out, align your paper to the eight inch mark for an eight inch book and pull out peg four and punch. Fold down the ruler guide to bind up to 24 inches. Use the wire cutters to trim your wire to eight inches and place it on the side of the cinch. Punch up to 20 sheets of lightweight paper at once, placing it on the wire after you punch. Once you are done, add the front cover and then the back cover. The front and back covers should be facing each other. Next, press down and turn the cinch guide to the size of your wire. Place the wire down and press the handle to bind. Use some pliers to bend the ends of the wire. Flip the back cover around for the final project. For a different binding, thread the spiral wire through the punched holes. Use pliers to turn the ends of the spiral binding. Use the square hole cinch to punch square shaped binding holes. Check out weareonthenet.com to learn more about the cinch.